So what is going on guys, my name is Unlogix HD Winter Star Plants vs Zombies Garden Warfare 2 video. Now today's video is going to be showing you guys how to get some legendary items and 500,000 coins in total. But the thing is guys, if you do not want any spoilers relating to the Golden Gnome locations or anything such as the rewards and all that good stuff, I recommend clicking off the video right now before I continue. Okay then guys, so I've given you the time to sort of pretty much click off if you don't want any spoilers. So for this to work out, for you guys to get 500,000 coins and a really, really cool legendary item, you need to go down to the Chamber of Gnomes after you've collected all 54 gnomes. I previously did a video showcasing what happens when you collect all of the gnomes and some rewards that get you 100,000 coins. But you actually need to go back into the room that opens up after collecting all the gnomes and you'll find a button. It's pretty similar to the buttons you've used to to find a few of the gnomes in online multiplayer games. This door will then open up from there and from here is pretty interesting. You can pick up another snow globe which is actually in the room and this is probably going to be the last snow globe a lot of people are going to need and you will then get another 100,000 coins by the way which is pretty pretty cool. But what you need to do is guys you need to go up to this little sort of wheel and it's a puzzle in a way. Now the puzzle you need to go for is an interesting one. It took me a while to figure it out but uh, eventually I did get it done and as you can see now I'm going to show you what you need to do to actually unlock the puzzle door. So the first one you need to go to is watering can, you then need to change to the second one on the wheel and as you can see it does take a little bit of time to do but it is flamingo as the next one. Then you need to go to the next wheel and uh, you need to go down to the fence I do believe. There you go, you need to go down to the fence and for the last and final one you pretty much need to go down to the plant pot and then you actually need to go up to the wheel click next wheel again which I didn't quite realize until I gave it a few seconds but there you go you go up to the wheel and next thing you know it starts showing you an animation revealing the door unlocking completely and uh, on the inside you're gonna be pretty amazed at what is there it was pretty cool to see this I was not expecting this and uh, it's certainly a very rewarding thing a lot of people got kind of frustrated with the only fact they got 100,000 coins really for collecting all of the gnomes but what most people didn't know is behind that little room was a whole new door with lots of other pretty much rewards for you guys to get and uh, as you can see there there is a gigantic golden gnome sitting there there's actually a jukebox type thing that you can actually play some music from which I found was really really cool so if you hold B down you can start the magic and it starts playing some music you then have three rainbow sort of chests but you actually have two chests on each side inside these two chests is King Gnomius or Gnomus sorry rain it is a backyard super rare item in the next chest you get another cool thing and that is a King Gnomus guard so you get two backyard items there but the next thing is going to be the coolest and that is going to be your first legendary item it is gnomish perspective which is a super cool legendary hat now the next two chests are going to be what you're expecting it's going to be 250,000 coins in each chest 500,000 coins in total and you've got obviously a hundred thousand coins from unlocking the first room so in total from this video guys you will be getting 500,000 coins which i think is just amazing i hope you guys have enjoyed the video if you have done leave a like Comment your thoughts down below and any other secrets and stuff like that that you guys find and want to share with everyone. Obviously, don't drop too many spoilers, just in case. And uh, as always, guys, I'll see you in the next video.